big city. That shit could be anywhere. This Gonzalez? Would you recognize any of his men? Maybe. Good, because if I was in the big city with just a few hours to kill, I'd want to get high with a brother or get down with a sister. And I know where the out-of-towners do both. Come on. Let's pop like cola. Hi everyone and welcome to part 59 of my GTA VCS PSP walk for 100%. Now we're working for Ricardo Diaz, who's probably, in my opinion, the most memorable character from Vice City. The way he gets frustrated with all his gadgets. It's too priceless. I think he destroyed a DVD player or a video player or something, and then Tommy Vassetti said to him, the plug's not switched on or something, and he was like, ah, oh, whatever, I can afford a hundred more. Yeah, wouldn't that be a nice life? You think we can trust Diaz? My man Diaz is a businessman, right? That's a no then. Oh, it's another one of those spookometer chases. Very. <laughs> Very popular GTA feature, the Spooko meter thing. Very traditional. Ah, oh, sometimes you can knock those lampposts down. Right, now I have to get on the jet ski and do a water chase. Don't lose them, Vic. Easy for Lance that he doesn't have to come with us. From this bit, it's very hard to judge your speed on these jet skis. And he suddenly speeds up this guy.
Probably one of the best aspects of VCS ever is this jet ski. It's awesome. More fun than any other boat. Yep, so we have to infiltrate the compound. Hey, who's that guy? Get off the jet ski, Vic. I hate these watchtowers, they're annoying. Oh, there's a guy over there, right. Let's deal with him. Ah, I've pretty much taken out most of them, so. Okay, right, I'm just going to go and get in the boat. Jetmax is a very decent speedboat anyway. You don't really have to take out those sentries to have a clean getaway. So yeah, all in all, pretty fun mission. I like it. And that's it for the mission, guys. Thank you for watching.